Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about your glutes. I have some new exercises that I tried today and I thought I would share them with you guys. They were very difficult, very different, and really fun. Sometimes it's nice to throw in a mix of new things. I've been sticking to compound basic movements lately. And so throwing this in and mixing it up was kind of exciting and fun and different and definitely made me sore. Um, today's intro is brought to you by Outside. It's beautiful out, so I got lucky. There's some construction going on in my house. So filming inside was not an option, but it is beautiful outside. There's a beautiful tree behind me and it's warm. It kind of feels like summer and I love it. I hope you guys are enjoying the videos. Um, I hope you enjoyed this glute workout. Let me know what you guys think. And if you guys are ready, then let's get into the video. Hey guys, so our first exercise in today's lower body workout is going to be walking lunges. We're going to be performing three sets of 10 to 12 reps per leg. I like to add some dumbbells for added weight. I think walking lunges is something that's really good to use as a startup in any lower leg day. Um, I feel like the first set is um, pretty good. It's a warm up and then by your second and third set you can really feel the blood pumping through your legs and it works all aspects of your lower body whether that be your glutes, your quads, or even your hamstrings. I think it's just an overall great exercise. And the next exercise is going to be something that I tried for the first time today and I loved it and that is going to be a front grip pulse lunge. So this is just a regular split lunge and hold the barbell like you were doing a front squat. Now this makes it 10 times harder I believe and I think because you are having all that weight loaded directly on that front foot and it really puts a good burn in your glutes and in that back leg. I think this is a fantastic workout. I think this is a fantastic exercise. I want you to go ahead and try to perform three sets of 12 reps on each leg. Next exercise is going to be a wide stance sumo leg press. I love these because I feel like they work every part of your body, of your lower body. I think that they are one, obviously great for your glutes, which is where the sumo stance comes in. And then I think anything sumo related really, really focuses on your hamstrings as well. But this is a regular squat, so of course it's targeting, targeting your quads. So really it's just an overall great exercise. Go ahead and perform three sets of 12 to 15 reps. Next exercise is going to be what I like to call Smith Machine Pistol Squats. Now, pistol squats are something that I think you have to be very talented, very coordinated, have very good balance, you know, all of those things that I really don't have in order to do. Um, I also am trying to grow my quad strength and that is something that I don't have enough to do this on my own. So I like to use the Smith Machine for assistance. Um, I think this is better than a regular squat rack because the bar is in place and it does not move. Try to refrain from using your upper body as much as possible in this. I like to keep that front foot out so when I hit the parallel position, my leg is up at all times. Go ahead and try to perform anywhere from three sets of eight to 12 reps on each leg if you can. And I think it's an awesome regression for doing pistol squats anyways. Um, you can also take this and do it onto a bench and sit onto the bench so you're not having to go as deep or as low as you do as I am doing here in this movement. But either way, something that can get you stronger like doing pistol squats is a great exercise and this is a perfect regression for it. Our next exercise is going to be one of my old time favorites. This is a donkey kick on the leg extension machine. Go ahead and perform three sets of 12 reps. Um, I just love this machine. I love doing donkey kicks on it. Probably just because it targets that under butt spot. It just really hits that. It focuses, you can feel really good burn in your quads. You slightly feel it in your hamstrings. I feel like it is just an all around great exercise for your lower body but more specifically for that under butt area that everyone wants to target. I think this is just a great exercise and it really focuses on your glutes. Set my heart afire. 
And our final exercise is going to be, well, I'm not really sure what it's called, so I just call it butt raises on the bench, um, because that's basically what you are doing here. Um, go ahead and perform anywhere from three or four sets to 12 to 15 reps. Go ahead and set the bench at an angle. You can make the angle higher, you can make the angle lower. I picked a medium angle. And go ahead and set your hips at the edge of the bench, and then you're just gonna go ahead and lift your legs up. You can go ahead and add a dumbbell for added weight. My hamstrings and glutes were on fire after this. I it took me a few seconds to get out of this position because it was so difficult, but it's such a great workout. It's one of my new favorites, and I'm definitely going to be adding it in more. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.